What's up guys, how are you all doing? For today's video, I'm going to put to the test another very strange knife. Let's see what this one is all about. Okay, let's open it up, see what's inside here. Boom. Whoa, wax paper wrapped up. Whoa, beautiful. As you can see, it's been a little bit used, but let me show you what's so special about this. So this is actually a knife and there's a mechanism right here. You just spin it like that to open it. Wait a minute, why is it not spinning? I thought it would be so easy to use, apparently not so easy. This is why directions are so much fun to have. I'm trying over here, open this, twist over here, but all you have to do is just twist this and it should pull out and boom, you got here fork and a knife. Seems very simple, right? Cut your meat, cut it up, but this knife seems to be pretty short. Guess what? All you have to do right here, spin it this way, line up right here, hopefully you guys can see, spin it this way, and then unfold it all the way. Boom, now we're talking. Now we have even longer knife. How cool is that? So, a fork and a knife, no problem. Chop it up a bigger pieces, use this as a fork. Wow. Does this come apart? I have no idea. Maybe I should look it up. No, I don't think this one does not come apart. On the picture it shows you to be a fork, a little one. So how cool is that? So once again, once you're done, just flip it over, twist this so it does not come off. And now you have a shorter knife and a fork. Once you're done, look at that. All you have to do is just line up and then put it in the holes, close it, twist it, push it all the way in, twist it this way. Boom. It's usually clicks in. I can't believe it. For a while there I couldn't even figure it out how to open it because it looks like you want to twist this whole thing right here. Nope. Just like that. Boom. One more time to show you how simple it is. Boom, big knife. So it's actually very, very easy to fold it and unfold it. Boom, so let's open it up. Comes with a knife holder, but beside the knife holder, there is a knife protector right here. And why is that? It's so weird, why wouldn't it fold all the way? I guess they come up with this different design. Don't even really know how to use it yet. <laughs> Hopefully I don't hurt myself. I should have read the instructions. But this right here is a blade guard and we need to fold it somehow before we can use a knife. To unfold it, what you will do is press it right here and unfold it. You see how it pulls up a little bit and to fold it up, boom, look at that, it's quick. Unfold it, again pull it up, and again we're gonna press it right here, and I'll show you another angle from this side. Pull it up, fold it. It's pretty comfortable grip, I have big hands, so it's nice and big, you can put a finger in like that, so different hand will feel differently comfortable. For me, definitely not comfortable to hold it like that. I would go over, but if I want to hold it like that, I'll put it like this. I know, use your imagination. This is definitely not comfortable like that for me. But yeah, most of the time I probably would be holding it like that. And to close it, you close it like that. This is so unique because usually why you like folding knives, because you have this big knife. But whenever you fold it, they are half smaller. So this is kind of defeats the purpose of a folding knife right here. It is kind of a folding knife, but folding handle and all you get is a guard of the knife. But still, your knife stays as big as it is, except now you cannot cut yourself and put it in a pocket. This is so weird and unique. I have no idea why they did it like that. But fixed blade knife sits in there very, very strong. Don't have to worry about it's ever wiggling from around there. But again, I do not get it. 
So you got right here, pretty cool tiny knife with the clip and also kitchen holder right here. To unfold it, all you have to do is just pull it up and then push it forward. How cool was that? And to fold it back up, you press it and then close it. One more time, boom. CRKT, this is who makes it, as you can see, and close it, boom. I wish there would be a way to just hold it like that and push it out to open it, but there is no way. You'd have to use two hands to open it and then unfold it all the way, slide it out, and it is a bit wiggly, but it is a tiny box cutter knife, nothing else. So it probably will work. You see it has a tiny, tiny screws out here. So I think for what it's made for, it is very, very cool and unique knife. Check this out. And to pull it out, same way. So cool. Let me know in comments below what do you think about this knife. So looks like a knife, right? You do not see the blade. It's supposed to come out from here. You flip this open and then you push this like that, fold it together and flip this down. As you can see, the handle is really, really short. <laughs> so I wish it was a little bit longer handle right here. But regardless, this is the burnt of this knife. To close it, you flip it open and then just push this up and then you have to fold it this way. Be careful, don't keep your finger in here because this is the sharp blade in here. Then you want to move your fingers away and close it. Very unpractical knife. It is not that easy to close it or open it. But still, I love when they super unique. You see how I pulled it up, this thing went to the side and now it's gonna get stuck. Boom. So there is no fast release whatsoever. Push this back, you see how this thing wiggles sideways, back and forth, boom, close it. Pretty fun though. I love this knife, definitely goes into my collection for very, very weird knives mechanism especially this is what I'm looking for so you close it like that close it I used this knife few times this is why it's kind of dirty it was nice you know what it's a knife is a knife but you can just tell it's pretty cheap and as you can see there's quite a bit of wiggle inside there side to side front to front so definitely not the most reliable knife let's see how this folded knife opens up at first glance, it looks like a regular knife, right? Well, let's look at it closer. This is made by USA Stainless. At least there is a stamp on it. That's it. Usually folding knives, you open it to the side. Let me show you how weird this one is. This is also the same brand, but different design as you can see. Again, if you look at it, it looks like a block of metal. To unfold it, you push it all the way around here, so the unfolding part is very, very slow. Then you have to line it up just perfectly to fold it sideways like that. Boom. And then you have right here a dagger knife. I've been actually using it as an unboxing knife. And honestly, because it's so skinny, and I mean not wide, but skinny this way, and short it actually very comfortable to open boxes with the tip like that the dagger tip was very very comfortable but what's so weird about this knife it's so much work to fold it back up you gotta line it up flip it over so let me show it to you one more time line it up if you don't line it all the way it doesn't go flip it over but overall even though because it has this weird design it doesn't jiggle too much. So it's pretty steady knife. Maybe the handle in and out a little bit, but I cannot even feel it. So then I have here another one, exactly the same design of a folding knife. You gotta flip it over. And actually this one even worse because if you try to flip it the wrong way, it doesn't close all the way. So this is even, weirder design of a folding knife so you gotta flip it over this way or this way 
without cutting yourself because sometimes if you push it the wrong way this end is sharp so then you flip it this way over boom and then you got a knife this one is very steady as well I like it as you can see it's been used somebody sharpened it not so good but nevertheless very very nice nice knives I really really like the dagger style way more well guys that's pretty much it let me know in comments below what do you think about this series I keep finding super super unique knives with the mechanism folding mechanisms like that I really like the ideas and ingenuity of all this type of knife I love them all honestly the more unique they are the better it's also came with the holder like that so that's kind of nice I got it on eBay so if you really enjoy it I'm gonna keep looking for them it's not so easy to find unique knives like that a lot of them they don't make anymore they only make so many and they get sold out because that's just such a fun thing to have as a collection of these very unique uh, folding knives each knife folds so differently and I have quite a bit of them now what this is like part six now so if you enjoy these videos make sure you thumbs up subscribe and I'll see you next time